everybody, this is Jason Harsh, and today we will be playing some Monster Hunter Try Ultimate. This is another one of my long lost series. Not another one, but one of my long lost series. I apologize for adjusting the volume on screen. So basically, this guy is telling me that the Legiacris is back. It's been sighted. Oh no. And that now I have to head out and go. So, well, let's go do that. After we talk to all the people, of course. No, no. Another care pigeon. Oh, more trades. That's fantastic. No rare commodities. <laughs> Alright, well, just a couple more people to talk to. And then we can go out and quest some more. Oh, more farming stuff. That shouldn't be too hard. Most of these. Um, this and this. These are both um, downloadable content. So that's why you see um, high rank stuff showing up there. The Crimson Gear Pack Upscale and the uh, Bath Sailor. But other than those two, these look like they should be pretty easy. Some busy bees, some shroom germ plus, some funky pheromones, and then some easy kill carbs. And then a f two frogs. Yeah, yeah, that stuff's that's easy. And then she's just telling me, again, that the legit person is back. So, yeah. So, urgent quest. Trial of the Sea Dragon. Compel the legit person. Let's see. Seeing as it's been so long, I do not remember anything that I have. So, I'm probably going to do the Warhammer. That or the Dual Swords. I might, I might have to do Plume Flint. Wait, why is... Yeah, I have to reorder. So, yeah. Perfect. Let's go. The reason why I'm using this hammer is because it has um, some good sharpness. It's got a little bit of green. Bounce bombs. Bounce bombs are pretty fun. Underwater. Hopefully I'll be able to knock it out at least once. Alright, let's see. 
one of those. So I'll use that. One of those. All right. So I think what I'll do is I will trade for a couple traps. I will trade for one of each. How far will these get me? Alright. Alright, that should be pretty good. Should be good to go. Using the voucher because I want to make sure I get this uh, slugger skill. That'll make sure that I can knock it out a lot easier. Alright, so. Have I really done all of these? Oh, okay. Alright, anyway. Child of the Sea Dragon. Alright, let's do it. You, Cha Cha, what other masks do you have? Just an acorn match. Well, let's select your abilities. Let's do earplugs, weather blake, weather breaker, and defense. There. Should be good. Alright, let's go. Time of the reckoning to come. Here's a little G cross is back. Blah blah blah. It's an area five. Blah 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 blah. Alright. Okay, the standard stuff. Take the animals too. Just cause. <clears throat> And sell for quite a little bit actually. Alright, so. Oh man, sleeping. Don't wake him up, anybody. Don't wake him up. Oh, do it. The tail of the Legiacris is the weakest spot, other than the chest. So, yeah. Go for the tail and the chest. And I don't mean it's like the back, but like the front, right, right there. Right, right here. Right here. Oh, it's a Oh 
man. I, I have a profile so much nicer than this one. Got evasion plus two. Here plus. So nice. Congratulations, kid. You did so well. Yeah, yeah, I know. He was awesome out there. So good. So good. Yeah, that fight was, um, that fight's tipped in your favor. Yeah, it's, it's pretty, pretty easy. However, the next one is going to be a little bit harder. A little bit harder. Awesome. Yes. Alright, let's just... I have some going out for treasure, some going out for fish. Alright, so... 
here to talk to. Just give me another villager request for more milk. The nutrients and kale extract. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh, hoo, woohoo, yeah, good job, you did it. Beat full of jeers. Yeah, you know, honey. Honey, okay. Honey, the guild he is. If you like that, well, okay. <laughs> if you don't, well, okay. <laughs> Personal preferences. Some of them are funny to me, others aren't. It's just me. Alright, well, now I have a lot more. Not more quests. Let's see, I can do a wrath in, egg run, another run, Legambi run, baggy run, and then a Giganox run. Um, I think. I think. that I might do a waiver and egg run. Just, just to end the episode. Yeah, I think that would be pretty, pretty good. Let's see, did we get anything? No. Just, just to see. Oh no, I need a catalyst. That's Juice yet. I think it once I get up to the top. Yeah, okay, Lander is a very nice skill to have. Because you just jump from 8 to 5 and then you're good. You're good to go. You rarely ever see the Raffian. If I had a little bit more time, I'd probably try and fight the Raffian, but not today, sadly. So 
I might, might be getting into another channel with some friends. I don't know if I said this in the last episode, was that a week ago, and I don't remember. Well, not the last episode like of this, but the last episode that I put out. Um, yeah, I might be getting into another channel with some friends. And then we'll all be doing that channel. Um, that would be called um, X Gamers. Because my friend's uh, YouTube is Card X Gamer, which I do recommend anybody watching to check that channel out. Pretty good content. I think so. But yeah. So this is gonna be really easy. Nice, easy egg quest. I don't see why people think egg quests are so hard. I mean, you just. You just run. <laughs> I mean, even if you don't have a dash juice or a feline lander, it's not. It shouldn't be. Even gargoyle eggs are pretty easy. You just get a bow gun. Get a bow gun, you're good to go. You shoot them from a distance. Because that's the thing with gargoyles. To get them to lay eggs, you have to come up from behind them. Or from somewhere that they can't see you. And then smack them. So you could... Could try and sneak up behind them, but you know, that the monster AI is kind of funky when they're on passive, so they might be doing anything. They might turn around randomly for no reason at all. But I just find it easier to shoot them and then get the egg and leave. Or shoot them, kill them, and then get the egg and leave. Because sometimes they get mad that you're taking their egg and they smack it. They're like, oh, you smacked me into the egg? Smack you back. Smack you right back. Is this? Yeah, yeah, it is. Alright, also. Hadn't seen the wrath yet at all, so a little bit confused. Not, these aren't the part. These quests. You just gotta know how to do them. Yeah. Same with um, most of the super big bosses. Like Jen, or Sedeus, or Guy Morales, or Latrion. You just gotta know what to do to not die. And even in the new game, Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate, you just gotta make sure you don't do something you're not supposed to do. And down the door, that thing, that's crazy. But it's it's really set up. Like, you know exactly what everything's gonna do. Exactly when they're gonna do it. Oh look, for a So, I don't really see it as all too hard. Hey look, they're on me. Finally sorry. And the only thing with the big bosses is that you run out of time. Like, if you try to solo them, you can run out of time a lot easier than if you try to do it with other people. Well, I don't know. I like in the new one that you can, uh, Oh, which, uh, you can meld them, all them together. Wait, I guess that's it for today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.